Oh, wow. Check it out. Deep in the Southern Pacific, a discarded cow carcass floats offshore. It's so hard for me to digest what I'm seeing right now. Whoa! Jeez. A shark has caught the scent. Oh, that is a big, big shark. And it's not the only one. This is a big one, too. Look at this. There's three right under the cow here, but I can see four, five, six, seven. And that's just in the vicinity. Within minutes, it seems like these tiger sharks know exactly what's going on. Oh, yeah. These tiger sharks seem to have no fear. Oh, Coming again, biting the engines. Holy It's absolutely bonkers. They're telling me this is our zone. Most tiger sharks would never come up with this kind of confidence under your boat. Check this out. It's hard to absorb. But what is behind this bizarre feeding frenzy? The answer lies in its location. 900 miles from the coast of Australia, in the Southern Pacific, is a speck of land, Norfolk Island. In the 18th century, this was a notoriously harsh and remote penal colony. After the convicts came the whalers, who were followed by the farmers. Now, 1,300 head of cattle roam this tiny island. But a severe drought is forcing farmers to cull their oldest cows. On Norfolk, the most efficient way to get rid of organic waste has always been to send it to the sharks.